Okay, open grade. Um, second attempt here. Uh, this window now, you can adjust the gain for the slopes and stuff like that. Show that later. Um, had to incorporate the simulator in with height and slope and all that other stuff. But uh, just like before, you start a new field. CFF. And then let's get going. And then the old manual button. Now you just drive to where you want to be. Let's pretend we're going to drain a slew. Go along. And it goes up. You can turn up the gain here. See what you're doing. It's tricky because this is really long and this is in the Y direction is really short. So the typical typical slew where you have to the slew is over here. You have to cut this edge away. Down there. So you get another little bump. And then down to there. And then you stop. So then that's your cut line now. You can turn up the gain a little more. So these are guidelines, these black lines. Uh, they're point to a meter away from the cut line. And so once we turn around and drive over it again. Okay, so now let's set this is the red line is the cut line. And you can adjust the height of it. Now if we wanted to cut here, and we can adjust the slope. So 0.026% grade. See, so we've got to cut that, we can fill that, cut the top of that. So I know we can do all the calculations for cut and fill, but this is pretty easy to see. Crank it up some more. Okay, so now we drive around along and set our depth. Now this number here is the difference between the blade, cutting edge of the blade, and your desired line. Up here is 0.2 meters, negative 0.2 meters from the line. So then control of it is just a matter of using this number and making sure it's zero. So that would cut or raise or lower the cutting edge. So it's all there. Um, seems to work really well. To auto gain this stuff is complicated because, of course, you can have this being a thousand meters long and then this is like height of 10 centimeters of what you want to cut or half a meter. So I have to figure out how to do the auto zoom on stuff like that. But right now you can just increase or decrease the gain. And again, you can set your cut line to whatever you want and the slope of it. So the cool part is you can see it all at, uh, at the time of design. So works pretty good. Uh, Confer some comments on what else this should do. Anyway, thanks.